Are you a dairy producer? Or do you grow grapes, nuts, fruits, or vegetables? We have it all with American Vineyard, Pacific Nut Producer, California Fresh Fruit, California Dairy, and Vegetable West magazines. Subscribe for free now at malcomedia.com. Stay current on the freshest news in your industry. Hello, I'm Matthew Malcolm with Vegetables West Magazine, reporting to you from the 2016 California Onion and Garlic Symposium in Tulare, hosted by the California Garlic and Onion Research Board and the UC Cooperative Extension. Growers today got to hear from several industry speakers, including Mary Ruth McDonald, who talked about controlling downy mildew in the field. And we've been very interested in screening fungicides for effective control of this disease. Uh, a picture of what happens when either the fungicides don't work, or probably in this case it was more a result of poor timing of the fungicide application. <laughs> Onion downy mildew is, uh, develops erratically. It starts in very small spots. But if the weather is cool and wet, um, three or four disease cycles, so three or four weeks, uh, can be enough to absolutely destroy all the leaves of the crop. So it's, yeah, it's um, can be very explosive. Uh, there are some effective fungicides to control downy mildew. Uh, timing of the first spray before the disease gets into the crop is really important. Um, there are a couple of new products, uh, Zampro and Arondis. Uh, I understand Arondis will be registered sometime fairly soon are excellent for control of downy mildew, but they still have to be on the crop before the first infection takes place. And with those products, as with most of the downy mildew fungicides, uh, we have to be careful to uh, alternate products so the pathogen doesn't become resistant to the fungicides. There are a couple of ways of timing your fungicide sprays. Uh, there are disease forecasting programs, so you can look at the combination of temperature and uh, the length of dew on the leaf, and that will let you know if conditions are good for downy mildew to develop. Uh, in practice, one of the easiest ways is that as soon as it shows up on any onion field in your area, then it's time to spray. Improve your pest and disease management by reading Vegetables West magazine. I'm Matthew Malcolm, CaliforniaAgnet.com. <laughs>